LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys. Notice, many times, laptop manufacturers produce keyboards that look the same on the outside, but have different retainer clips underneath the keys. To help you find the correct repair video for your keyboard, we've created a searchable database. Simply go to LaptopKey.com, enter your laptop brand and model number, scroll down to the bottom of the page and click on View Videos. A list of all compatible videos will appear. Select the retainer clip model that matches your keyboard. That's all, you're now ready to repair your laptop keyboard. For this keyboard, we will be showing the removal and reattachment of the H key for standard size keys, Shift for the wider set keys, and F9 for the top row smaller keys. For removal of the standard keys, take a tool or your finger and insert behind the top right corner and pull up gently until the key removes itself. To remove the retainer clip, simply support the top of the clip with your finger, insert a tool from the bottom, apply gentle pressure upward, and the clip comes right out. For reattachment, begin with your clips. On the bottom clip, there are two notches towards the top of the bottom clip. And for the top clip, there is a flat piece at the bottom of the round opening. Simply attach the two together. Click, click there. Hinge down from the top using hooks here and here. Take your keycap, place on top of the clip with a firm press, and the key is back on. For removal of the wider set keys, simply insert your tool or finger behind the top right corner, apply gentle upward pressure, and continue around the edge of the key until it detaches from the metal arms and clips. To remove the metal arms, simply lift up, push one end to the side, and remove, and repeat for the other clip. To remove the retainer clips, simply support the top with your finger, insert a tool at the bottom, apply gentle pressure upward until the clips remove themselves. To begin reattachment, start with your two clips. On the bottom clip, there are two holes that will be facing towards the top, and on the top clip, there are two holes towards the bottom. Simply click the two together, hook from the top, lay down flat, then grab your metal arms. There are small holes here, 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 and here for each set of arms. For the top arm, hook into the top set of holes and lay down flat and repeat for the bottom arm. Lay both of those down flat. Take your keycap, lay on top of the arms and clips. Give it a firm press all around the edges and the key is back on. For removal of the top row keys, take your tool or finger, insert behind the top right corner, and pull upward with gentle pressure, and the key is removed. For removal of the retainer clips, support the top of the clip with your finger, insert a tool at the bottom, apply gentle upward pressure to both sides until the clip removes itself. For reattachment, begin with your clips. On the bottom clip, there will be a rounded edge here with two holes at the top. For the top clip, you will want the thinner holes on the bottom. Simply click the two together, then connect to the hooks here and here from the top. Small push, take your keycap, lay down on top of the retainer clip, to push, and it's reattached. We'll now show you how to remove a laptop key. Simply pull on the edge of the key in a gentle but firm motion. Lift up and remove the key. It's that simple.
If your key is loose and not sticking properly to your keyboard, your retainer clips are likely broken. This issue can be fixed by replacing your retainer clips. Replacement laptop keys and retainer clips can be purchased at LaptopKey.com. LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys.